My name is Alana Powell and I'm with Boldly Me and I'm here to help you become the best version of yourself and today we're going to talk about healthy self-esteem and healthy self-esteem is when you understand and know yourself you know what good things you have and what bad things you have and you know realistically what you need to work on to make yourself a better person well, if you have healthy self-esteem, you say, gosh, you know what? I'm really good at art, but I need some help with math. So maybe I'll go talk to my teacher and get some help. Or maybe I'll go talk to my friends and actually get them to help me, you know, but help me become the best version of myself because I'm not so good at this math problem. If you have overly high self-esteem, what happens is you say, I am the best of the best of the best and nobody needs to help me. I'm great at math and I'm great at art and I'm great at everything and you never seek the help that you could be benefiting from for improving your math. That's a good example of how overly high self-esteem hurts you. Now if you have low self-esteem what happens is you say I'm not very good at art and I'm not very good at math and everyone else is better than me. And even though you're, say, the best artist in your class, or one of the best, you will pull yourself back and get in your way and say, well, maybe this other person should give their artwork because they, they're better than me. So you get in your own way and you still can't become the best version of yourself. So finding and understanding what your strengths are and weaknesses are and going and getting the help you need to become a better version of yourself is really the best way to go. So with that, I'm going to leave you with the challenge of becoming someone with healthy self-esteem. And I'd like you to repeat after me the boldly me promise. I accept and love myself as I am. I am responsible for the choices I make in my life. I will be boldly me. Now go out there and be the hero of your own story. Take care and I'll talk to you soon. To learn more about this lesson, please visit our website to access the worksheets pertaining to this topic.